ever saw how almond milk is only good for like a couple days when it's fresh, but if it's from the store, it has all this funky stuff in it and it lasts like weeks, right? So I'm gonna show you how to make almond milk from scratch and have it be delicious and fresh. And once you've had this, you don't wanna have it any other way because it's so good. So here we go. We have some almonds which have been soaked. Always buy raw almonds and then soak them ideally overnight, but at least for one hour. And this will actually take out some bitterness that's right underneath the skin, okay? Then take your almonds, put about a cup in. You could put more or less really depending on how thick you like your milk. Oops. Dropping the spoon. Um, so then put in some water. Always use obviously filtered water. You could do double or triple the amount of almonds. And I mean, really, like here's like a typical almond milk here, guys. And I mean, it has all this gums and oils and riboflavin, zinc, gluta, whatever, that, right? You don't want that stuff, especially for your little kids, right? So now we're gonna put on the Vitamix. And, and I like to blend it, then we're gonna strain it. Then we're going to add in some flavorings to it. We're gonna bottle it, and then I'm gonna show you a recipe that is amazing that you can make with it. So here we go, let's blend. top because it'll start bubbling up as you can see here as we open this so we're gonna open it Whoa, I've been working out there we go it's nice and frothy we're gonna pour it through a nut milk bag with your nut milk bag put the uh, nut milk bag inside out so um, almonds don't get caught in the threads that are on the inside and then pour it through okay give it a shake grab it if you want to use gloves feel free pull the string oops Squeeze it like you're milking a cow. Ever milked a cow before? Are you gentle on the other? Okay. <laughs> All right, and then this almond milk, you can use it for a face scrub, mixed with coconut oil, mixed with honey. You can use it um, as a thickener for soups. You can dehydrate it and put it into cookies. You can make your own almond flour, so it's very versatile. You can use all of it. Um, if you are gonna save the pulp, make sure you refrigerate it, okay? Because it does have a lot of life force and it can get moldy. This has about a three day shelf life, okay? So there you go, you got all of your beautiful pulp right here. You have your amazing milk right there. Wow, that's awesome, right? Now, let's spice it up. We got some sea salt, okay? A little bit of salt helps um, balance the flavors. Some cinnamon, really great for memory, okay? If you remember stuff. And some vanilla extract, or you can use vanilla bean powder, just a teensy bit. I like to then, oopsies, nice, pour it into my little jar here. Wow, I should have been a bartender. <laughs> there we go. Cheers. And now put your top on it, you can shake it, because when you store it in the fridge, you're gonna want to um, shake it up because it will separate. So there you go. Now, with this almond milk, let's talk about what you can make with that. I made this amazing little tree, and you can see how it looks there. It's basically blueberries, chia seeds, and almond milk, and it's super good. So you got yourself one of these little mason jars. These tops you can buy on at, um, Ace Hardware or some hardware store. That way you're not dealing with the rusting of the typical mason jar top. And then I'm using some um, blueberries. Wild blueberries are a lot smaller. And we're going to scoop in our blueberries, place them at the bottom, include some of the liquid. Then a couple spoonfuls of chia seeds, kind of scoop that in. Okay. Then now you're adding in your amazing almond milk you just made right here. Just like that. Okay, now we're gonna wanna mix it up just a tiny bit. If you like these recipes, I mean, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you know when I'm putting up awesome recipes and videos for making your life easy and incredible. This kind of goes in the fridge and just lets it let it hang out there for, I like to do it overnight. So cheers, everybody. Enjoy your fresh almond milk. Make sure you comment and subscribe, as I said before. And stay beautiful, people. We'll catch you on the flip side. Cheers.